This is Deuteronomy 4, verses 1 through 14. And this is about Moses' commands obedience. It says, Now, O Israel, listen to the statutes and the judgment which I teach you to uh, teach you to observe, that you may live and go in and possess the land which the Lord God of your fathers is giving you. You shall not add to the word which I command you, nor take from it, that you may keep the commandments of the Lord your God, which I command you. Your eyes, I gotta, I gotta use this so I can keep track. Your eyes have seen what the Lord did at Bel, at Bal Pior, for the Lord your God has destroyed from among you all the men who followed ba Baal of Pior. I'm horrible at like pronouncing words, so bear with me. But you who held fast to the Lord your God are alive today, every one of you. Surely I have taught you statutes and judgment, just as the Lord my God commanded me, that you shall act according to them in the land which you go to possess. Therefore be careful to observe them, for this is your wisdom and your understanding in the sight of the people who will hear all, all these statutes and say, Surely this great nation is wise and understanding people. For what great nation is there that... He, that has God so near to it, as the Lord our God is to us, for whatever reason we may call upon him. And what great nation is there that has such statutes and righteous judgment are, as are in all the, this law which I set before you this day? Only take heed to yourself and dil diligently keep yourself, lest you forget the things your eyes have seen. And least they depart from your heart all the days of your life and teach them to your children and your young grandchildren, especially concerning the day you stood before the Lord your God in Herob. When the Lord said to me, Gather the people to me, and I will let them hear my word, that they may live to fear me all the days they live on, that, on the earth and that they may teach their children. Then you came near and stood at the foot of the mountain, and the mountain burned with fire to the midst of heaven, with dark, darkness, cloud, and thick darkness. And the, Lord got, and the Lord spoke to you out of the midst of the fire. You heard the sound of the words, but saw no form. You only heard a voice, so he declared to you his covenant, which he commanded you to perform. The Ten Commandments. He wrote them on the tabernacle. On the he wrote them on two tablets of stone. And the Lord commanded me at the time to teach you statute and judgment, that you might observe them in the land which you cross over to possess.